purpose of this demonstration is to show you how to waterproof this rough opening. I've constructed this wall out of light gauge metal and dense glass sheathing. For that, the first requirement is chip prime, which is applied onto the cut edge of the sheathing material. If you're using CDX, OSB, or even CMU block, you do not need to use JIP Prime and you can go straight to applying fast flash. Step one is to use our JIP Prime product to solidify the cut edge to minimize that, get rid of the chalkiness. First, shake it up accordingly. It comes in larger jugs when it gets on the job site. I'm gonna use just a, a small nap and roll it on. Uh, I do have a chip brush to get into some of the tight corners. Sometimes it's necessary, sometimes it's not. So I'm just gonna roll it over the edge. This product, uh, Jip Prime, is our uh, cut edge sealer. It solidifies the chalk so that we can then use our rough opening material, Fast Flash, to waterproof the opening and have a bondable substrate. Now that the Jip Prime is cured to the touch, I'm gonna to proceed with applying Fast Flash into the rough opening and out onto the face four inches at a minimum. To do this, I'm gonna use a variety of tools. A flexible spatula, a caulking tool, because I will end up having to detail the inside corners, and then I like to carry a, um, a chip brush with the bristles cut down in case the surfaces are very irregular. It becomes very efficient versus a flat tool. The last trick that I like to do with my, uh, with my spatulas is if I'm only having to come down a minimum of four inches on the face, I cut the tool down to four inches. So I have my unanimous gauge. I'm gonna apply three beads into the rough opening, consistent beads. I'll eventually knock them down. I'll end up doing my inside corners last. Now I'm just gonna knock the material down uh, to an opacity which is actually 12 mils. You can always certainly uh, use, a, use a mill gauge to, to check, uh, but one of the characteristics of the material is that when you can't see through the, through the material itself, it's at the specified millage of 12. There are some tricks with using any kind of a blade as well. Um, oftentimes you end up striking it in a little bit of a diagonal fashion to pull it to the edges that is required. But the consistency of the bead helps lay, lay down the material as well. So consistency is a, is a, is a factor in all this. I just put a bead of material in the corner, so now I'm gonna to tool it with my caulking knife. Now the rough opening is complete. Once cured, windows can be installed.